two, one. What's up guys and welcome back to another episode of Cork to Glory. This is episode 69. Nice. And today we are returning with, man oh man, the Champions League final as we take on Barcelona. As we go for the treble on the back of what was an incredible FA Cup final, which I've just played. So I'm recording this directly after that thriller of an FA Cup final. Whoops. Um, and I tell you, man, I am nervous as hell for this. Because this would be, if we were able to put it off, my first treble. And I don't even know how many FIFA years. So the nerves are real. The excitement is real, though. And I tell you what, even if we don't win it, it will still be an incredible season. Our first ever domestic double... But I so badly want to win it now. I so badly want this treble. We'll take to the game. Uh, we'll bump it at half an hour, six minutes. Uh, we're playing at the Johan Cruyff Arena. Uh, Slider's still untouched. Uh, default on 50. And, yeah, absolutely buzzing. And on the back of that incredible FA Cup final win against Chelsea, where you just saw him there, I think that man is going to be marked very tightly indeed for this, our first ever Champions League final. So Bell Bell will start this game on like the FA Cup final, whilst Ida is our top scorer in Europe as well as the Cup. He'll be taking a seat on the bench. Bazunu's back in, the GP will start, and Luke Byrne will be back on the bench as well. So it's our strongest possible lineup for the biggest game of the series. Champions League final, Barcelona. And a chance to win our first ever treble. No pressure, Doxy boy. But bring on Barca. Come on! So the nerves have shot up by about a thousand percent on the back of that FA Cup final win. I actually thought we were going to lose it until Cunningham scored that late goal. I thought we'd lose on the shootout. So into the final of the Champions League, of course I want to win it, pick up our first double. But knowing the treble dream would have died before the game even kicks off, I wouldn't have been as nervous. But now, I swear man, the nerves, the chance to win my first treble in God knows how long. Of course we won one in the, FA, uh, in the Football Manager save last year. Cunningham. In the FM say with Norwich last year. Samuel Bell Bell. Teddy Gray buries that. <laughs> Man. How did he get out so wrong? He scored the first goal in the cup final, finds Devine. Now into Cunningham and now Keenan. Cunningham was very deep to start this game off. I need to get him a bit further forward. Or his most impactful. Oh, that would have been sick. Frankie de Jong with the interception. Barca will clear. I've got to get the ball to Cunningham at every opportunity tonight. He's the one that will make things happen. And Leo. He's just an absolute tank, isn't he? Here we go. Looking for that opening. Oh, and cleared by Militao. Cunningham was waiting. Good start, this. Oh, I've got Pelletier way out of position. I don't feel comfortable right now. I need to get him back in the middle. There's Barca. Can't find an opening. We've played some lockdown defense in this first half. I'll be telling you that right now. And there's Healy. Oh. 
should have finessed it. Like in the FA Cup final. Oh, that's a slice, that is. Well wide. Should have just finessed it twice. I've sliced a shot when going through one-on-one. -on -one. Been on top. Blown both chances. Never a good sign. Barca have not had a chance. Fatty is a top scorer in the Champions League, but he's barely had the ball at his feet. I've, I've literally just isolated him. And as first halves go, whilst we're still deadlocked at 0 0, I could not be better, not be pleased, more, more pleased, I should say, on my defence. Absolutely locked Barca down in that first half. 45 minutes of that, and one goal will be enough. We've got to make sure we take the chance, unlike in the first half. Come on. Well, first half statistics read like this. Barcelona shots one, on target one, it was blocked. And for us, shots three, on target zero. That's not good, is it? And Barcelona have dominated possession as well. Should be leading. I think we'll get a good chance in a second. Oh my god! The shark has just bitten a hole in Barcelona's heart. Cork City lead in the final. Through club captain, first ever man out of the academy, Barry Sharkey. Right. <laughs> I don't know what to say. Just everyone calm down. Sharkey! Go on, son, off you go. Go on, son. I am going to play lockdown defense for the next 35 minutes. I am not losing this. I'm all forced in tears. Right. This is All Star Game 2020 final possession lockdown defense. Nothing is getting past my back for. Very shocking! Come on! My heart is beating faster than the first day I had last year with someone I thought was genuinely a 10 out of 10. I'm literally just right now. Absolutely. Oh, to Stegen. Brilliant anticipation. I mean, literally. Oh, you are joking. No, 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 Bizarro. I was going to say bricking it, which I am. Come on! Careful, careful. GP's out of position. Keating forced to come inside, but that's okay. As we shall clear. Oh, and I see him running, baby. Go on, Barry. End the series, end the series, end the series. <clears throat> end the series. It is over.
I'm done. I'm finished. I could stop doing FIFA career mode videos and never make a single one ever again and be totally satisfied with how I finished it. I am finished. Count down the seconds, because it is over. And the last thing we do is see Sharky make a tackle. Not once, but... Okay, I was going to say twice, but a jockey and it's over. And I tell you, I'm literally done. I'm absolutely done. As far as series finales go... Is that one the best ever? I'm going to say no, for sentimental and nostalgia reasons, but... I'm speechless, man. Absolutely speechless. There are no words to describe that Champions League final. Just enjoy the moment. Ladies and gentlemen, your Champions League, FA Cup and Premier League winners. The treble in Season 7, won by Cork City. And lifting all three above his head, club captain, club legend, first player out of the academy. Barry the Shark Sharky. Ladies and gentlemen, it is over. When I say lockdown defense, I mean absolute lockdown defense for 90 minutes. The top scorer in the Champions League and the Golden Boot winner, Fatty, did not have a single sniff. But the left back for Cork City scored his first ever hat trick. I'm absolutely done. The series is over in the most spectacular, incredible, perfect fashion. Where do we go from here? How do you improve on that? Well, I tell you what, for my next career mode, I don't know how I'm going to do it. But I've got one heck of a challenge ahead. Trying to make that series as good as this one. We've grown up as a team. <laughs> From League 2, half a star, the first time I've ever done an RTG in the fourth tier English football with the worst team of all time. We've gone into the history books. We'll go down in Doc's folklore, the amount of legends in this team. And the biggest of them all is the guy I talk about last to end the series. He's led this team to great things. No, I don't know what to say. Thanks for your time. But I'm out, baby. 
Ah, là, là. Wow. But obviously I'm not, because I need to show you a few more things. <laughs> Can you imagine if I just like, mic dropped, I'm out of here. But I need to show you a few more things, since this is the series finale. Um... I, I don't know what to do. <laughs> well, I was thinking what I could do, um... Is... Do like a, uh... Like a special series finale video like with my uh, QPR save, but... Actually, um... Don't think I'm gonna do that. Look at those three jerseys there. Uh, instead, I'm actually gonna wrap up the series today instead of doing a special video instead. Um... So what we'll do is we'll run through the team one final time. We'll do a brief look at the other leagues and stuff like that. And, um... I... I'm literally... I'm genuinely... I don't know what to say. I don't... I'm... The human monologue has been stunned silent. I don't know what to say. Chelsea won the Carabao Cup. For those interested, also you know who won the FA Cup in the Premier League. Uh, the Super Cup this year was won by Fiorentina. Obviously, he would be playing it next year if we were going to continue. But I'm sorry, as much as I'd love to try and defend the treble. What a seven-goal thread in the Europa League final. As much as I'd love to try and defend the treble. I can't improve on that ending. You, you can't get better than that. It's literally perfect. Man, I'm sorry if I'm going to bumble along my words for the next five, ten minutes, but you're used to it by now, right? <laughs> but uh, I, I'm just, I'm, I don't even know what to say. Oh man, those goals, that performance, that ending from the beginning of this save, it's just. Perfect. Like, as a creator, as a content creator, as a producer of these sort of saves, my number one goal always is try and make it the best it can be. There's nothing I'd change about this series, nothing. Every time I end a series, I think, oh, maybe this season I, I, I could have done this, or maybe I shouldn't have signed that player, or, you know, maybe this, that, or the other. But, like, literal perfection. Just absolute incredible, and, and the, the ending, a dream, I don't know if I'll ever have, I don't know if I'll ever have an ending to a FIFA career mode like this ever again. And that's saying something, you know, with all the endings, of all the series finales we've done, all the incredible Champions League finals, all the incredible, you know, five, six, seven goal thrillers, all the drama, all the, you know, penalty shootouts. This one, I'm not going to say tops the lot, but I tell you, it's certainly, without question, top three. <laughs> no doubt about it. What your top three might look like, I don't know. But I tell you, for me, probably top two, thinking about it. Man, oh man. Honestly, I was in tears, or, or close to being in tears, but I'm gutted I'm not going to be able to use Bogart, though. <laughs> the, the Belgian at the academy looks so good, we won't get to use him now because we're ending the series here, but we'll take one last look at the squad, we'll see our official final team rating as well, oh, it's going to take a while, let me do this off camera, hold on. When we began this save with the half a star Cork City, I always dreamed that one day we would end with a squad like this. But the players who got out through the academy, the bargain of the free agent in Samuel Belbel, perhaps the bargain of any series I've done. Well, all I can say is I could not be happy with how this series panned out and with how it finished. Absolutely unbelievable. No, got to change that around. <laughs> Absolutely unbelievable. Absolutely class. Got to change that around as well. Oh, I am so happy. If, if you could see me right now, I'm beaming with my goofy teeth sticking out very far indeed. There is nothing left to say other than what a series, what a journey. 
What an ending. And I can't thank you guys enough for being with me since the very beginning. Seven seasons is how long it took to take Cork City from... <laughs> ah, half a star League 2. To Champions League, Premier League and FA Cup treble winning. Glory. And he got 10! He got 10! I just realised he got 10! <laughs> he got the 10th with his hat trick in the Champions League final. You know, I tweeted the other day, um, I'm actually getting emotional over a FIFA career mode sale. It wouldn't be the first time. I tweeted the other day, Leo, Leo, I tweeted the other day that one day I dream of being able to afford my own home, which is a dream which is probably quite far-fetched based on the way the house prices rise in the UK. I'm sure many of you guys know that feeling all too well. And, and, and to renovate my own home office. Now, if I'm lucky enough to still be doing this in a year's time, let alone in several years' time, if I'm lucky enough and blessed enough to still be able to do this as a job, then I want to renovate that home office, record all my videos in there, and what I want is for when I resume and restart doing face cam videos... I want to have on the wall um, the the shirts or like shirts that I'll buy from the club websites and then get custom printed of the names of my heroes and my legends throughout all my FIFA career mode and football manager saves and there'll be a lot of them so it'll have to be quite a big room because there might not be enough wall space the real deal Cunningham 35 assists have you ever seen anything like it well with Charles Ball but not this many um, but yeah, sorry, I want to I wanna have all those names on the wall. So we're talking the likes of the Alpha Male, Jason, number 50, Ivan Tony, the Shocker, number 40, you know, and so on and so forth, Marcano and Niang and, and so on and so forth, all the way through. And, you know, in this save, one of the reasons why I've loved this team so much is because so many players have been just as important as each other. And no one can deny that Samuel Bell Bell's goals are the reason why... We were able to win so many trophies. No one could deny that Eamon the Real Deal Cunningham was our big game player. But for definite, the biggest legend of this save, and he proved it in the final episode, the series finale, Mr. Barry Sharkey. And I think that will be the first shirt I purchase off the Cork City website. Get that number three, Sharkey jersey. One of my favourite legends and heroes of all time. And it is over. And I can't say thank you enough, guys, for all the support. Since the very beginning of the save, from the humble beginnings to where we are right now. Treble winners in Season 7. Our first ever Premier League, back-to-back -back FA Cups and the Champions League as well. Leaving behind an incredible Cork City team. With a great academy, lest we forget. But with the best ending to a series we possibly could have had. From the very beginning, from League 2, title winners, promotion in League 1, and after two seasons in the Championship, getting up to the Premier League, or after three years, we win the title to go along with back-to-back -back FA Cups and the, Premier and the Champions League as well. Thank you so much, guys, for all the support on one of my favourite FIFA career modes. We've had 200 wins. Could this have been any more fitting? Thank you, thank you, thank you for the most incredible, incredible support on the most incredible series. One of my absolute favourites of all time. An incredible ending. It could not have been more picturesque. Cork City are Champions League winners. Control the drop and we are out. Much love guys, sincerely. I can't say thank you enough for all the support. Not just on this series, not just in this season, but from whenever you started watching me. I love you guys to pieces. I really, really do. This has been a series finale and a series I'll never forget. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Much love. Thank you.
feel like crying. 